So a large percentage of people in Western countries uh, experience hay fever, sinusitis and allergy-like symptoms where they get runny nose, sneezing um, and so forth and it's often linked to pollution which may well be one of the causes. Another potential cause is the muscles in your face. So if you have knots in these uh, muscles or areas of tension within these muscles it can actually cause those symptoms of having a runny itchy nose, um, itchy eyes, uh, sinus like pain. So I'll show you where the muscles are and how you can fix them yourself. So just along your eyebrow, what we call the medial third of the eyebrow, on either side there's a muscle in there. So if we use your fingers, um, keep them together and go straight into just above the eyebrow, just underneath where the arch of the eye is and working into that area. And you may come across a particularly painful point and you want to just massage into that area for 60 seconds. I'm moving in an upward and downward motion, you could move side to side or in a circular motion. When you press on that area you may feel it refer up the head, into the nose, into the sinus area, um, along the side, this side of the nose and that's, that's a good sign. So working along further along, I can feel slightly higher up this time, a tender point there, so just working inside there. And I want to do that on both sides. The next muscle, so that's obicularis acoli. Uh, very important muscle in terms of causing those symptoms. Next muscle is called zygomaticus. So we've got a zygomatic bone here just underneath that. So underneath the cheekbone we're going to work with the same contact fingers 45 degree angle and we're going to press into that area and look for any particular sore points. And I can find one there so I'm just going to massage into that area just up and down for 60 seconds taking nice deep breaths in and out as I do it working all the way along underneath the cheekbone into that muscle, releasing all the knots in that muscle. And I want to work all the way down up until my teeth. So I can feel another point there. And you're just fishing around the area to find any particular areas uh, or problematic areas. So once you've released off all of one side, you want to release the other and you should find significant relief from your sinusitis and hay fever like symptoms. Um, you, you will need to focus on doing this um, as a repeat treatment, so doing it um, as, as often as you need to in order to get relief and then addressing some of the causes that could be causing this. So in terms of facial expressions, postures, all of these things can affect your facial burns, also stress levels um, can all have an effect on the muscle. So I uh, hope that helps.